Okay, there is no way that I can explain what just happened. But I will say this. In my last job, I got into a heated argument with a possum who was in black and white for some reason. If you ask me, that's creepy as flip. Not only that, but I was jump scared by a guy just because I was rude to the cats from Cat Scratch. I'm sorry that he couldn't accept the fact that I'm a witch and he wasn't. I swear, I'd better not see him again. And now, this is the 53rd time I've been fired. Where will I work next? Oh no. I will work at Spencer's. Welcome to Spencer's. How may I help you? I want to buy two Doctor Who scarves. One for me, and one for a friend of mine, since her birthday is coming up. Okay, but where is your friend? I don't see him. She's actually my Disney counterpart, but it's for another Alice. So you're that Alice when Madness returns? That's it. Normally I'd tell you to get out, but your game scares me, so I'm going to traumatize you instead. Okay then, frick it. It's bad enough that I was traumatized by my parents dying in a house fire, but if you're going to scare me like that even more, I'm done. I'm going to target instead. Whatever woman. How about you burn yourself to death along with your own house? Be quiet. How about you freeze to death in the Arctic? If you play the Ultra Combo sound effect, so help me. Ultra Combo! Oh my freaking gosh, you mother! Well that's enough of that. Back to the show. Welcome to Spencer's. How may I help you? I want to buy a PlayStation hat with a lava lamp please. Okay. That will be 666 trillion dollars. What? No way Jose. I am not paying that much money for a lava lamp and a hat. Besides, the actual price for both items is 52 dollars. Get your math straight. You're looking at the items on discount. What? Even if I did have that much money, I'm not paying that much for a freaking hat and lava lamp. You're just saying that just to get more money. What is this now, the lottery? You know what? I've had it up to here with your bull crap. Get out. Fine. I'm out this brat and going to Hot Topic instead. Welcome to... Wait a fudging minute. Aren't you the same employee from Barnes & Noble? Uh, no! No, I'm not. Oh, okay then. I would like a Japanese Nightmare on Elm Street shirt, please. Okay. Give me your panties and I will sell it to you. I knew it. I knew it. I knew that you were that same bloody employee from Barnes & Noble. Well, in that case, you're a liar and screw you. I'm going to Kohl's instead. Well great. The dumb brat found me out. Oh well, guess every lie can be covered up forever. Welcome to... Wait one den minute. I know you. You're Yalai, the alligator fatty in orange. Yes I am. They're a problem. Screw you in your fat delicious pa. I don't serve fatties. Next to the dark stalkers, I hope an earthquake causes your mansion to collapse on all eight of you. Okay, that was uncalled for. You know, Henny, Polar, Nuts, Wall, and Rilla told me all about you. We were both put on Earth by God himself, but compared to me, you're going to heck. No, you are. My friends and I the only people going to heaven, while goody two-shoes like yourself are going to hell. Joke's on you, cause I believe in God and the fact that Jesus died on the cross for our sins. I'm going to Sam Goody instead. Rolanda. How freaking dare you act freaking rude to my freaking customers. You're a freaking burden on my freaking business. That's freaking it. You're freaking fired.
Get freaking out right freaking now. Ugh, fine. Screw you, Neil. Excuse me? How about you come back over here and say that to my face? Ugh, it's too late. She's already out the door. People these days. But anyway, that's all folks. Tune in next time.